This video is to show you how to link your Unicard with your Shopee Seller Center and how to migrate, match, update the products from Unicard to the Shopee Seller Center. Before we proceed to the next part, there are a few terms that we need to share with you so that you are able to understand better on how the system works. The first term will be the word migration. This happens when the product doesn't exist in Unicard and the product is already available in Marketplace. The system will then migrate over the product from Marketplace to Unicard. The second term will be the word sync. This is when the system passes the product details from Unicard to the related marketplaces. The next term will be the word matching. This is when the system establishes a connection between a product from Marketplace to a product in Unicard, provided that the products are having the same SKU across all marketplaces. Last but not least, we have the term override. This is when the system takes the product details from Marketplace and save it to the product in Unicard. For demo purposes, I will start with a clean store without any products. To set up the Shopee integration, firstly go into Marketplaces, look for Malaysia Marketplaces, click on Shopee Sync, and for the first time users, enable the button for Sell on Shopee. Then you will need to click on the Authorize button. You will be directed to the Shopee Open Platform app, change the country to Malaysia, then enter the username and password to log in to your Shopee Seller Center. Continue by clicking Confirm Authorization. Please wait for a while for the system to load and once done, you will be directed to the Shopee Sync page. And if you have multiple Shopee stores, please ensure that you entered the correct credentials for the correct store. As of now, my Unicard is without any products and all of my products are in my Shopee Seller Center. What should I do next? Firstly, you can send an email to us to migrate the products from your Shopee Seller Center into your Unicard. So you won't have to recreate the whole listing again. You can send the email to support at sitegiant.my and provide us with your domain and tell us that you want to have your products to be migrated from Shopee to Unicard. And if you want to migrate manually, you can go back to your Shopee Sync main page, click on the More button and select Shopee Manual Matching. From there, you will need to select the store that you have just linked and click on Search. Let the system to load and you will see the products from the seller center showing up. You can click on the orange migrate button and the system will pull in the data from Seller Center and enter it into the Unicard product list. Once the product is migrated over to Unicard product list, you can see two green buttons instead of the orange migrate button. And now, what are the differences between Override Shopee Sync Data and Override Unicard Web Store and Shopee Sync Data? Unicard or Web Store Data is the product details directly from product, product list. And if we click into one of the products here, Everything that we see from this product page is considered as Unicard Web Store data. And now, what is Shopee Sync data? Shopee Sync data can be accessed by two methods. The first method is to go into your product page and at the right marketplace column, click on the action button for Shopee and you will be directed to the Shopee Sync page. Another method is to go into marketplaces, look for Malaysia marketplaces and click into Shopee Sync. Click on the action button for the product and you will also be directed to the Shopee Sync page. So everything that you see from this page is the Shopee Sync data which will be synced directly to the Shopee Seller Center. This means that you can have separate sets of data for your web store products and your Shopee Sync. And if you already have products in your Unicard product list before you link to Shopee and if your Shopee have the same products in your Unicard product list, you will need to ensure that the SKU are the same in both sites. Then, go into Shopee Manual Matching, look for the product and click on Override Shopee Sync Data. The system will then establish a linking between the product in the seller center to the product in Unicard. If the SKUs are different, it will then appear as Migrate. In this case, kindly edit the SKU from either one platform to make sure the SKU are the same throughout all platforms. And now, I am going to show you how to sync a new product from Unicard to Shopee. Firstly, go into Marketplaces and click into Shopee Sync. From here, look for the new product and click on the green plus button. You will then be directed to the Shopee Sync product page. From here, all the basic information will be populated from product list. Scroll and look for grouping. Select the correct category. Enter the product attributes. 
please be reminded that all of the product attributes will be different based on the selected product category. And there's one more note for you to remember, all the attributes with the weight asterisk will need to be entered. Once you have confirmed all the information are correct, you can click on Sync Now. And now the product has been successfully synced over to Shopee Seller Center. If you want to update product inventory levels and pricing to marketplaces, kindly do it using these two functions here. Use Marketplace Inventory Management to update inventory levels and use Marketplace Pricing Management to update the selling price to all related marketplaces. The links to the videos are as below. So this is how you integrate your Unicart with your Shopee Seller Center. Thank you for watching the video.